to succeed in life, you have to believe in yourself. Please like and subscribe to help my channel to keep going and open the eyes of millions of people that are in the chains of religion. Religion and success in your life. You have to believe in yourself and create goals, intelligent goals, to achieve a successful life. But religion teach you to put your hands in God and when things are not going good, the preacher tells you that God is testing you and you should thank God for testing you. And that is the biggest lie and weak excuse of these religious leaders. And what God these religions teach you to believe on? A God that they create. A God that loves you unconditionally, but if you don't do what He wants, you are going to be going to hell. A God that supposedly created everything in seven days, and at the seventh day, He was so pleased and happy for what He has done, and He went to rest. But at the eighth day, He regret created humans and are, was ready to destroy everything he did. A God that supposedly knows everything, knows the future, the past, the present, everything, but he creates things that has done supposedly a terrible uh, damage. He created the devil. Well, if he knew the future, why he creates something that will revolt against him? Then also he creates humans and put them in this uh, garden. But in the middle of that garden, he put a tree that he don't want humans to touch or eat out of it. Even though he knew, because he know everything, that eventually humans will touch it and eat out of that tree. Then the question is, why he put it there? If he knew the devil will revolt against him, why he create the devil? That can be mean two things. One, he don't know what he's doing. If that God exists, then how we can trust on him. Or two, that book called the Bible is full of stories and fantasies created by a human. Because that God that is happy one minute, angry another, create things and later on he regret creating them, sounds more like one of us. And these religious leaders teach people to put their lives in hands of that God. And they wonder why their lives are so miserable. And I tell you why, because you and any of these religious people that has put their hands on that God that religion has created, has put their future their lives on fantasies. They have put their lives on a man-made God and they expect things to get better. Don't put your life on a man-made God because it will be the same if you put your life on the hands of Santa Claus or the Tooth Fairy. Put your life that belongs to you and you only, in your hands. Don't let the preacher or any religious leader make the decisions for you. 
because the decisions they will make you do is give them money. You have to create a plan of how to achieve your goals. If you have problems, you have to use your brain to create ways to get out of the challenge and make your life better. Nobody is gonna do it for you, but your own self. Remember, these religions will keep you down in chains because they are where they want you. That is why religion was created, to keep people down as slaves. If you wanna fly high, break those chains. In this year, 2022, take charge of your own life and stop believing in fantasies.